Antonio Texans would not be ready to field the team this season. Then came word of the trade. Not just any trade, but the biggest trade in the history of the CFL, if not in the history of sport anywhere. A total of 16 players involved, eight from the Toronto Argonauts and eight from the Edmonton Eskimos. Toronto would like to announce, along with the Edmonton Eskimos, that we have made a major trade that I think will uh, have a tremendous impact on both our football teams in a positive manner. Hugh and I have, and uh, Bruce Lemmerman have been working on this for last couple days. Um, what I'm going to do is tell you who we're passing on to the Eskimos and who in return will come to the Argonauts. Toronto is trading to the Eskimos. Ricky Foggy, Daryl K. Smith, Eddie Berry, Eddie Brown, Leonard Johnson, Don Wilson. Bruce Dixon and J.P. Esquerdo. Yeah. You move into the microphone, please. Thank you. We got your list. I got my own notes. How many players like both? Hang on. The uh, Edmonton Eskimos are trading to Toronto. Craig Ellis. Travis Oliver, Enos Jackson, Chris Johnson. We're trading our rights to uh, Cam Brousseau. Uh, we're trading uh, Ken Whiney and John Davis and Tracy Ham. Now, the players involved in the deal are scattered all over Canada and the United States, and reaction by them and their teammates has been predictable. Well, I actually had a meeting with a young man this morning, and it was at 10 o'clock, and I was on my way. And just as I was walking out the door, I got a call. Like all trade, when someone gets traded, they're just walking out the door, and, and Ronnie tells me um, there's a trade been made. I should come by his place before I mute this guy. Um, so needless to say, I had to cancel my meeting to learn that I had been traded. Getting Tracy Ham, I mean, that's... Uh, uh, to, to let go of a player like that is very difficult. Uh, you know, we did it a year ago when we didn't resign Matt Dunnigan. This is for financial reasons. And, uh, but to, to gain him, his abilities, his quickness, his size, his strength, and most of all, his leadership qualities. He's a winner. And to play in the Sky Dome, that's going to only enhance all of his abilities that he has. Uh, to get Ellis, who's a top, one of the top uh, slot backs in the league, uh, we give up Daryl K. Smith, who is also one of the top guys.